Today, Kevin and I are gonna be trying six flavors of the late July tortilla chips. We have the nacho cheese, the Mexican street corn, garden ranch. And a jalapeno lime, Hawaiian habanero, and scorching sauce. These were $3 each at Meyer, And they were, cheap. they were on a huge display. Mm -hmm. You couldn't miss them. Um, so we're gonna try the nacho cheese first. Made with organic yellow corn. This is a 7.8 ounce bag, 221 grams for $3. Uh, the regular price, I do have to say, was $4.99. So I don't know if we got a bulk yeah, discount. <laughs> they were on sale. They run a big, they run a big pallet in the middle, like in a display yeah. and section. Maybe they were just on sale. Okay, it says our nacho cheese tortilla chips bring new meaning to the word Id idilicioso. It does say I do. delicious. It says I don't know. If that's, oh, like a, I don't know, like explanation points. Oh, delicious. I see. Oh, okay. So it's delicious. I thought I thought that's a new word. No, it does look like an eye because it looks like an eye. Yeah. It's literally a letter I. Okay, made with organic corn and seasoned with real cheese. They taste so good. You may just become as obsessed with them as we are. Um, eight servings in the container, 12 chips, 28 grams, is 140 calories. They are distributed by late July snacks in Charlotte, North Carolina. Pretty cool. It tore a little bit, a little bit funky, but that's okay. That's okay. I just cut them. So are these going to be like a Dorito? See you know what, they're well coated with uh, powder. That is a Dorito comparison. Oh yeah. I actually think those have a little more spice to them. More seasoning. Yeah. Um, yeah, because I mean a little, not burn really, but just a little tingle in the back of my throat. Oh, I'm not getting any of that. Just from like, this, just the peppers and stuff, the pepper in there. Um, like salt and pepper, pepper. I wouldn't want people to think they're spicy in any way. Mm. They're not. No more so than if you put a lot of pepper on something. Yeah, I, I, do, I don't get that at all. Mm. To me, pepper. they taste a lot like a Dorito. Um, I usually like them better. Yeah, these are really, <laughs> really good. For me, honestly, it would come down to price. Uh, like, I would compare the size of the bags, and I would compare the price. Uh, because I think these are, yeah, just as good, if not better than Doritos. Mm -hmm. Because we don't... I like that extra spice in there, though. Doritos are... Doritos are got plenty of spice in it. That has just a little bit something more in it. Yeah, you're getting more... You're getting something that I'm not. I mean, it's got a good um, cheesy flavor, too. But I like them quite a bit. Yes, the cheese is really nice. Mm -hmm. If you care about organic and all that, then, um, of course, you'll go to these. But if you don't care, like me, it's going to come down to just which one's yeah, cheaper, cost, which one's them. more affordable. But I do like them just as much. And they're not, they're about the same texture. So the they're about as same part of it as you can get I don't know why. Gets to show all the muscles. I have no muscles. <laughs> I don't have any muscles. I don't have any muscles. I know, you're drawing all your muscles by insisting upon opening them like that. Open. I'm pretending to be She-Ra. Okay. This is Mexican street corn. Our Mexican street corn, oh, same thing. Delicioso. I said it right that time. Mm -hmm. Made with organic corn and deliciously bold seasonings. Okay. 140 calories for 12 chips. I don't know why, but I was. It's got a little lime in there. Does he put a little bit of lime? No, no. There's something like a little acidic in there. You don't get any lime in there at all. Maybe it's crazy. Mm -mm. It might not have lime. It just seems like there's something acidic in there. Uh, I like them. Organic whole ground, yellow corn, vegetable oil, corn seasoning, organic sour cream, cultured cream, um, mil uh, paprika for, for color, garlic powder, parsley, 
cheddar cheese. I think it's just the, the it's the cheese. I mean, there is Sorry. plenty of powder on them. Mm. It's um. It's good. It has kind of a, a sweetness. And it's not what I mean by sweetness. I don't mean like, like honey or something. Yeah, like that. I don't mean like sugar, but I mean I like think it's corn. just the corn. Yeah. yeah, I think it just tastes like a a sweet corn. It's kind of like I was expecting like a, I don't know why I was expecting this, but I was expecting like a sweet corn, like you're eating a corn on the cob, which I don't know why I was expecting that because if, if you see Mexican street corn, it's got that's just a corn on co a corn on the cob with seasonings and spices all over it. Mm. So that's um, no, it's good. It's not my favorite. I, I like the regular nacho better, but it's good. I'm thinking too that uh, you are get probably getting some of that parsley. Mm. Um, Something comes across as a little citrusy, like a maybe a, a little acidic. Maybe it's just, mm -hmm. uh, they're not hot though. No, 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 not hot. At all. Okay. Yay, but, scissors! It's quicker. It's it much is. Quicker. It's, it's a lot quicker. Why fight it? Why fight it? Okay, Garden Ranch. Mm, these are good. Kosher. No artificial flavors, colors, or preservatives. Uh, made with organic corn and deliciously bold seasonings. That's the same thing. These are only 130 calories. Weren't those 140 or something? 140. Yeah, these are only 130 for, for 12. Both of these are 140. Okay. These, I think, are... They might be a little softer than a Doritos. Like that little tang in there. Little yes. zing, little zip. Yeah, you, um, yes. You get <laughs> um, the onion powder, garlic powder. It has white vinegar powder, lemon powder. Mm -hmm. um, Good. I'm yeah, I like those quite a bit. I'm gonna get one that's really well coated. They they do remind you a little bit of a four inch, but they're not quite as strong. But I I like them quite a bit. I knew. What? I tasted it and then I saw it in the description. Dill uh dill um, yeah dill seasoning, mm -hmm. and you can see it. Oh, you yeah. see the green, but that is what you taste the most is that dill. I use that same dill. Um, dill weed in uh, oyster crackers. Mm -hmm. It's delicious. I love yeah. dill weed. No, oh, that's ranch. Ranch dressing has the dill weed. Yeah, and, and that's what you taste the most. Mm -hmm. You taste that dill the most. It tastes like ranch, then. Those, um, I love those. Yeah, they're very, very, very good. Okay, am I trying those? Yep. Yeah. Okay. Now we're getting to the peppers. <laughs> okay, jalapeno lime. Okay. Jalapeno. Jalapeno lime. Uh, 130 calories for 12. Jalapeno is a little, usually a little hotter to me than Tammy. Mm -hmm. Lime juice powder, jalapeno lime seasoning, jalapeno pepper, green bell pepper powder. Let's probably add some, some of the pepper flavor. Mm -hmm. I like those because they do actually taste you get that green pepper flavor, mm -hmm. but um, they also have some heat to them. They're hot. So know. they're hot for you even? Yes. Mm. You but can I'll, only imagine what they're doing in my time. <laughs> but yeah, because because ah. I'm, I'm a jalapeno enthusiast. Yeah. Um, I really like jalapeno. Uh, they mm. are hot. Very hot. They're not like, they're. I'm sure they're not having the same effect on me as they are on Kevin. Kevin's probably miserable right now. No, they're, um, they're comfortably hot. I wouldn't want them any hotter. Comfortably hot, I like that. Yeah. Well, no. if they were any hotter, it'd be like painful, but they're not. Probably no. Yeah. <laughs> they're, no, oh. they're a nice level right there, and I do like the flavor of them, too. I like the flavor of them, too. It's not, and normally I would not like lime. You really don't get the lime. I didn't really get lime at all. No. I got more lime out of the Mexican street taco, or corn, than I did those. Uh, <laughs> yeah, you really don't get the lime. You really mm -hmm. just get jalapeno. Yeah. And it even nice. said it had like bell pepper powder or something. I didn't get that. I'm like I said, I think that's just to get that. Out. I think it's just to give it that green pepper flavor. I, oh. I truly think that. Do all of these have a? No, only those two. Oh, well, this one is Hawaiian habanero, which habaneros usually kill me. 
but this says medium. Yeah, so and it this has, one says hot. It storage. has a mild, medium, and hot, and this is, the, the thing is on, uh, what do you call that? Medium. The pointer. Yeah. The pointer is on medium. The gauge, whatever. The gauge, thank you. It looks like a gauge in your car when you need gas or something. Does it still look like that in the car when you need gas? Okay, I don't pay attention. Uh, vegan, no artificial flavors, colors, mm. or preservatives, 12 chips, 140 calories. Mm. I like that. Uh, it, they all say the same thing. Mm. Oh. Pineapple. Huh? It's pineapple. I was gonna say it's sweet. It's sweet like a pineapple. It literally has a little bit of a pineapple flavor. I'm wondering if you're gonna get heat though. This one has a lot of powder on it. It was like like we said, Tammy usually the habanero really are hot to you. Um Normally they are. I'm not getting hardly any heat at all. I'm getting heat, but I think the jalapeno ones are hotter than the habanero yeah, ones for yeah, me. I think so too. Yeah. It's a different heat too, because the jalapeno is really more fast. Mm -hmm. um, if these are more of a slower burn, so that it builds up a little mm -hmm. bit slower, but it's not as intense. So it is hot, but mm -hmm. it's not too hot to handle. No. These also, to I mean, have- You get that little stinging tingle on your tongue. Yeah, oh, yeah, no, definitely. But to, to have all that heat though, it's amazing how sweet they are mm -hmm. because these are sweeter to me than that street corn. Oh yeah, they're definitely sure. sweet. Yeah, they're they're the they're the sweetest ones mm -hmm. here. So it, it, I taste pineapple and heat. Yes, no, that's what they are. Mm -hmm. I think they're really good quality. Yeah. I think if you love habanero and pineapple, you're gonna love those. Mm -hmm. Yeah, they do a good job of getting the flavors in there. Now these are are hot. Yeah, they're, they actually have them on the hot. Yes. Like, yeah, they're warning you. They're not trying to hide it. And it's called scorching sauce. So, 140 calories for 12. This is not going to be pleasant. Red Diablo. Let's see. Vinegar powder, white distilled vinegar, spices, chili, pepper, cumin, uh, onion powder, garlic powder, cayenne pepper. Cayenne pepper sauce, cayenne peppers, salt, garlic. I tell you what kills you on these things. Paprika for color. What kills you at these? A regular potato chip, if they're hot, you chew it and it's pretty much gone really quick. These are tortillas. You have to chew them a lot longer, so that means they're in your mouth longer. Mm -hmm. and it's longer for those spices to just sit and mm -hmm. sink in. Those are hot. I've been holding back. Mm. They're hot. <laughs> it's like a smoky heat too though. Whew. Yeah. Almost painful. That would be like a flaming hot level of heat for me. You ate another one like a crazy person. Well, I had only eaten half of one and it wasn't that bad. Oh my, I'm burning up. Um, like I said, you're chewing them longer. Mm -hmm. So I think it gives the spices longer to settle in. I really do. Yes. It, um, Ooh. yeah. <laughs> yeah, it feels like my nose is gonna run. Oh, it's not that bad for me, but it's pretty, pretty hot. It feels like my nose is gonna run, slash, I have to sneeze. Um, yeah, <laughs> one or the other is gonna happen. At least we haven't got the hiccups yet. No, so really but hot. I think if you ate enough of those, you probably would get, you would get the hiccups. I think <laughs> you would. Your um, body rejecting the heat. Yes, I, I really think you would get the hiccups. I think if you like hot food, those are really it good. It is hot and it is hot all over my mouth. Mm -hmm. It's different than a, it's, it is flaming hot, but it's, it's beyond for me because flaming hot is more, it has a, a seasoning, a, a, a flavor. This is just like, I'm going to make you hurt. Yeah. Hot. I mean, I get a smokiness from it. I do have, yeah, I do you get do. that smoky pepper. But flaming hot, like those, that's a different flavor. That's more like a, it, most of the time it's with Cheetos or yeah. something like that. So and I, you get a little bit of a vinegary kind of So I associate like flaming hot more with cheese, yeah. whereas this doesn't have that no, cheese. It's, it's literally like hot. a hot sauce. Yeah. Um, I like them okay, they're just way too hot. I think they're I mean, excellent quality, yeah. and if hot is your thing, 
you're going to be so pleased with those. Mm -hmm. You're really going to like yeah, them. I think all of these are good quality. Yeah, whereas the jalapeno and the habanero were kind of a, a stingy heat, like little bees stinging you, this is just like overall burn. Like it just feels like you're, you're on fire. <laughs> now, the garden, I'm thinking about Doritos in my head. The Garden Ranch did not taste like a uh, Cool Ranch. Cool Ranch. They're, they're not quite as strong. Like, no. Like I think Cool Ranch have a little bit more of a zip to them, a mm -hmm. zing to them, but those don't. Yeah, but I like the Garden Ranch because I got the deal in that. Mm -hmm. um, and for the Doritos, I don't get that in Doritos, what I mean. No, I'm just, not really. No. Um, the, gar the Garden Ranch are my favorite. Here. Um, because I love the deals, just I'm just crazy about it. I, I'm gonna have different favorites uh, than Kevin. I'll tell you my top three. Garden Ranch would be number one. Yeah. Jalapeno Lime would be number two. And Nacho Cheese would be number three. Um, hmm. I'm debating because I really like the Garden Ranch ones too. I'm debating between those and the nachos. Just one of those two would be my number one. Kevin eats, uh, Kevin's uh, much, eats a lot more Doritos than I do. Mm -hmm. Doritos is something that I never choose. And that's what I was gonna say. These are all really great quality. And if you are the type of person that you get a different flavors of tortilla chips, then you're gonna love that these. Is very, very good. I, Full of flavor. I'm not that person that if I buy if I'm buying tortilla chips, I'm buying plain tortilla chips and I'm using it for a dip or something. A dip. I'm using it to scoop up cheese or I'm yeah. using it to scoop up salsa. I don't buy flavored tortilla chips. I'll I'll go to a, a potato chip. Kevin though, you do yeah, occasionally buy Doritos, Doritos. Cheetos, whatever. No. Um, I'm gonna say the garden ranch as well. And then the cheat the nacho. I, I wish they had the Hawaii ones were a little less hot because I'd probably pick those. Because the, that, that, that. I like that little sweet pineapple flavor in mm -hmm. there. Yeah, but this bag. That's our That's definitely number one. Yeah, yeah. this is this is. But the, the regular bag. nacho ones are really really good too. Um, I think they're really. Good. I think they are too. If you don't like dill weed for some reason, then get the. Get those the are just like Doritos. Yeah, yeah I'd like. Yeah, they're some. not quite as bold and. and uh, some of the, the cheesiness of it, but they got a really good spice flavor. So. Yeah, I just think they're very good quality. You just mm -hmm. need to compare prices. If you could care less about the organic part of it, then compare prices yeah. and whatever's, whichever's cheaper out of Doritos or these, then, then I would get whichever mm -hmm. one's cheaper because they're both good. So I will have a picture for you at the end, and thanks for watching.